Hey guys, and welcome back to Terror from the Deep. When we last left off, um, we redid the ship, and uh, we came out of it. It wasn't flawless. We did lose a few people. Um, we do, I believe have some more people on order so let's just have a little look at that shall we so base information transfers yeah we got two dudes coming we've got some more rounds and a new tank because we do need to replace those the research and manufacture is going we're getting some more iron armor which is great uh, research is magnetic navigation and over here we are researching apparently nothing um, We can research alien origins. I don't really want to do alien origins just yet. Let's transfer some stuff. To get some research going. Uh, transfer to R and D. We want to transfer. Um, yeah, we can transfer corpses. Um, might not be a bad thing, I suppose. We can transfer you. We can transfer Tazuth Corpse, Lobsterman Corpse, Biodrone, um, Tricene Corpse, sure, one of them. Uh, Magnetic Nav, we've already done. Alien Construction, we can transfer, I guess. Yeah, Learning Arrays. Oh, we've got some soldiers here that are alive. We can't um, transfer these guys. Because they're alive. Wow, we've got like lots of living Aryans. Interesting. Okay, well, we'll leave it for that for now. I want to get a workshop uh, started over here. We've got the wide array sonar going up. Living quarters. Do we have um, the equipped submarines? Nice. We've got dual sonic oscillators on these bad boys. That is going to give us some serious firepower increase, which is rather nice. Don't need torpedoes anymore. Um, they are obsolete. Sonic cannons we're going to hold on to. Disrupt the pulse launcher. I want to start researching this. We, Before I assault any alien bases, we need these bad boys ready to rock. And that is exactly what we're going to do. Not a huge amount to sell, um, to be honest, but... Hey, that's fine. Okay, cool. Let's go. Um, wow, that's all of the shit arriving at this base. Excellent. So, new project. Let's go for... Let's get some corpses researched because we're kind of lagging behind in that. Not sure that they're actually essential for anything, but it's better to to get them done i guess um got some more dudes that's cool okay go to base aquanauts we've got a lot of wounded men as well which is a little bit awkward uh we who's wounded for the longest three days you're almost back 18 days 11 days 17 days so 18 days out um, you can actually take your armor off and the other newbie can have it because that's how we roll. Uh, you are both armored up now, aren't you? Excellente! Sweet! Uh, that will do for now. Um, they should, we'll, we'll make sure they're actually, you know, equipped and on board. That's looking rather sad. To be honest, <laughs> not many men at all. Tempted to just maybe get some more actually. Purchase recruit. A couple more dudes just because we really need more men. Okay, let's get that going. Now we have. Let's wait till we have a million in the bank. Oh, small, very deep. Barracuda 3, intercept. Now we've got that much scratch, let's uh, build, we don't want base, hang on, base information, yeah, living quarters ain't great and we definitely need more storage, um, but build facilities, let's get a workshop going, 800 grand, but we need it, 
we really need it. Uh, standard interception. You are a relatively small boy. Get the fuck down. Okay, Barrack or Triton. Triton, go. If we could get there before night, I would be a happy camper. And it looks good. Sweet. Begin. Let's roll. Um, yes, I guess. Uh, we don't. We don't really need to be rolling with these anymore. Not for now, anyway. We've kind of got a backlog of corpses and whatnot to uh, get through, anyway. So we'll leave it with that. Ammunition is a concern considerable concern you don't need two spare packs of ammo to be honest but you could take some sonic pulses because you can and those that can should okay um, another sonic pulser I guess really need to yeah be very careful with our ammo um, you don't need, you probably aren't going to need to reload, but you might need to throw a grenade. Uh, yeah, you can, okay, we have so many of these sonic pulses, it's rather delicious. Uh, take your ammo off, let's grab some nades, that's fine, sure, okay, that will do. H, you don't have any explosives, any meaningful explosives, I should say. That's a little bit better. Okay, cool. Not a fan of this map. Oh, what can we see? What can we see? What can we... Okay, not bad. Not bad. Happy with that. Aim shot. H. Oh, that's Emmanuel. What is your... 72% to hit. Solid kill. Scratch one green bastard right off the bat. Ooh. Oofed. Okay. Um. Yeah. Not. Not sure I like that. Actually. Okay. Let's get. Let's get some people out. All right. Oof. Not happy with this at all. Uh, I'm going to voice my opinion and concern right now. Let's get some people out and ready to go. Oof. Uneventful first turn. I like it. You gotta like those uneventful first turns. Get up there, my son. H, what does it take you to snap? You can duck. Good man. You can duck, so duck you will. Let's get you up there. 27. What do you need? You need 26, so you can go up here. Alright. Okay, so, I mean, we have the sub on lockdown, more or less. That's fine. You can start exploring. I will give you an exploration buddy. As well. And then we can get two people. Probably safer to breach. Probably safer to breach from the inside. Or the open side I should say. That'll do. Oh! Oh, we have hostiles. Dude. Time units reserved for a snapshot. Okay. Can't see anything up there. There was definitely some kind of movement in here, though. I'm not buying your fucking selling game. You, how much do you need? 30, so you can get ready with that. You know what? You can peel off 
and check this little place out. I sure as shit am not buying that. Okay, we know that there's something up here. We saw it. Don't really want to have to rely. There we go. There he is. Whoa! You have something that I do not want you to have. 40... 41. So if you duck, it gives you 64% chance to miss. Yeah, that's why I said 64% chance to miss. Alright. Let's do this the hard way. If we can. Can you get that out there? Good man. Well now. <laughs> well, that was a series of uh, unfortunate events, shall we say. Or fortunate events. Depending on how you look at these things, I guess. Um, oh, man. Yeah, do not like. Do not like this. 29 to shoot. Oof. Okay, you can keep that place locked down. Who's next? You. Keep it going. There's definitely something around here. Not sure what. But I don't trust it. No, sir. What do you need? 29. So it's the green. So if you go there, you can still get a round off. And you. Look out yonder. Definitely could be setting this up better. I'm aware, but slowly does it. That's apparently a hole. 29 to snap. So we can go there. Okay, we're ready. You boys, say you boys and girls. XCOM is a equal opportunity institution. Everybody is equally expendable. Right, now those guys have got that locked down, we can start working our way up here. Although, that's the edge of the map. Nope. Um, this. Yes. This is not a very big map. And uh, I don't mind that, actually. Very tempted. Come on. Why can't I? Oh, right. Yes. Oh, I don't like doing that. Don't like walking into the fog. The fog of war. Right, that will have to do for now. You guys. Don't know if we have any KIAs in there. Alright. Yeah, not liking this at all. Oh! Oh, you sneaky little tosser. Kill him. 60%. 69%. Oh, right in the face. Oh, and we got Z Bite for that. Very nice. And a lot of aquaplastics. All of which we actually really needed. Good stuff. That was a very clean, very, uh, very controlled sweep. That's what we want. Okay. Oh, Magnav. So, magnetic navigation. These units generate a spherical multi-layer magnetic field, which the array projects up to 1,000 meters around the sub. The alien navigators are directly linked into the machines and feel their way around the invisible world beneath the waves. 
The interface system operates using alien modified cerebral matter that communicates directly with the operator's brain via neural link. Damn. And now we can get magnetic iron armor. Holy shit, guys. Um, mag armor is a game changer. Hey, guys. Guess what we're going to go for? Guess what we're going to go for? Bio drone. Where is it? Where is it? Mag iron armor. Best armor in the game. Uh, sure. Good. Let's equip our subs. So, that's fine. Equipment. Get the scout back on board. Excellent. All right. Happy with that. Now, the only trouble is... Okay, go to base. <laughs> Our armor, this magnetic armor, is now officially obsolete. So, we shall keep it for the rookies. Essentially. Which is... Okay. Everyone, get on that. I don't know how you make this infinite. There is a way of doing it, I believe. I don't know why. If I stop that production, new production. I know there is a way of making that unlimited. I thought that was magnetic armor then. I was like, holy shit, all of it, please. Gorse pistol, gorse rifle. Heavy gorse. Where's our particle disturbance sensors? There it is. Start. Yeah. Okay, interesting. Not sure why. Can't just make that in unlimited quantities, but sure. Uh, okay, okay, okay. Done. Now we're going to really rack up the money. Medium. Center. Barracuda 4. Kill it. Now we're armed with our new um, sonic oscillators. Ah, if we can head it off there, that would be quite nice. Just over the Euro Syndicate. Come on, splash that target. Oof, there we go. Standard attack. Come on. Good shooting. Clean kill. Okay, one thing I should do. What did we get from that? We've got a lot of sonic cannons now. Don't really need that many sonic cannons. Need all the sonic blast rifles we need. Gas cannon rounds. Don't need the gas cannon rounds. I must have bought those by accident because I am stupid. Sonic blasters, thermal shock launchers, sonic pulses. Bearing in mind, we've got 53 of those on the ship already. We've got a nice amount of Zerbite, which is nice because Gilman corpses, which is nice because I believe we need those. Yeah, okay, self sack. So that gives us nearly a million in the bank. Which, uh, first thing I'm going to do, build facilities. We want, what don't we have here? We don't have a lab here, but that's fine. We don't really need a lab. We're kind of on it as far as um, scientists go. But what we could use, we've got the wide array sonar going live soon. So we could get a general stores 150 because this place will need storage. I don't know if one workshop is going to be enough. Probably not. Another living quarters is going to be needed as well. So build facilities, living quarters. They're not cheap, are they? But we need them because we're going to have a lot of uh, scientists and engineers there. Ooh, ooh, 
Kill it. Wondering if we can just wait it out for that one. Oh, he's fucking out of there. Yeah, you don't want none of this, buddy. Ooh! Have to do it. We have to do it. We cannot say no. We cannot say no. I was confused then. I was like, what, 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 what? Equip submarine. Uh, come on, come on, come on. You're back in. You're back in. You're back in. That's better. Okay. What about... Equipment is all good. What about armor? Iron armor. Take the armor off these guys. If they don't have it. Iron armor. Wounded, wounded, wounded. Okay. Alright. Okay. Barracuda one. Oof. Should I say Triton one? You know what to do. This is going to be sketchy. Hopefully we can catch this one with its pants down again. I don't like the fact that it's night time. Yes! But I do like the fact... Uh, do you like the fact we're back up to full strength? Yeah, you're going to have to take that. Unless, what is your strength? You could be a grenadier. Uh, we will give you that. I didn't think about that. We've got a load of new dudes. So, weapons is an issue. Everyone pretty much has everything. That's fine. You know what? That's fine. I'm sure it's fine. If it ain't fine, well. <laughs> Ooh. You know what I didn't arm everyone with? Ooh. And the tank is just about scrapped already. Which isn't the end of the world because these things suddenly have become relatively inexpensive to us. Can you go around the right way, please? Uh, okay. Can we see what shot at me, please? Oh, it's a Gilman. Well, all fucking righty then. Problem is, it's a Gilman that's wielding high end weapons. Not enough time units. Do you have enough time units to drop it? You do, but then you obviously can't walk away. Uh, <laughs> um, okay, nearly made a colossal fuck up there. That was almost stupid. I almost put us into a position there. Oh! Where's all of our flares? Oh, I wonder if all the flares got destroyed. Well, that's gonna make this difficult. Yeah. Oh, I don't know who just died. Oh, suddenly not not quite so confident about this mission. That was not our rookie that died either. Suddenly not very confident, guys. Whoever shot was around here. Oh man.
Yeah. Oh man. Oh man. Um. Give me aim shot. Nothing. Nothing. Get back in the boat. Oof. Not sure about this at all. Grenade is activated, 10. So you can... How much to drop? 8. So you can drop it. Someone else... Yeah, you're not really... Gonna have the ability to throw it very far, are you, Hitch? But if you can, just kind of get it out there. Maybe back in. Can you get back inside? Yeah, kind of. Got him. That's positive. Oh, man. What? the hell. This is now very scary, very worrisome mission, because quite frankly, we made a bit of a silly oversight, and I might I'm very tempted to take our losses and run with it. But it's not really how I like to do these things. Oh god. Oh, you're all alone. If we can get to the where is the sub? We don't even know where the sub is. We're just going to get picked off. We will just get picked off. Unless we organize some kind of firing squad. Up here. And we get our rookies out. To explore which is a legit strategy that can work to be honest and it might be the only strategy we have oh man the trouble is you are just so outclassed at night you really are absolutely outclassed at night. And there's going to be a heck of a lot of them. <sighs> right. Laura? You're going to have to go into the big blue. Sorry, I didn't want this to happen. But under these circumstances, we don't really have many options here. I am extremely tempted to just say, fuck this noise and get out of here, but we really do need those materials on the ship. We really do. Okay, well, everyone else, the fresh meat, 
You're gonna have to be our eyes and our ears. Once we get into the sub, it shouldn't be too much of an issue. Oof. Oh, hey there, fella. Hey there. Oof. You may have... I was going to say, you may have just saved everyone else's life. Oh dear. <laughs> oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Oh dear. Yeah, this is... This is... Uh, situation is FUBA. Pretty sure. Because if you don't see who shot at you... Which you do not. Oh boy. Um, gonna. Gonna need you to kill the douchebag in front of us. Thank you. Who has a med kit? Who has a med kit? There is no one there. Well, I mean, there kind of is. You're now fine. I mean, you're not fine. Um, you can now throw the medkit to you. Where did the medkit go? Thank you. You guys are idiots. You can now use the medkit and heal you. Okay. You're going to have to advance into this scary grim <sighs> scary grim night this thick ichor that we have going on here I wonder 32 TUs to arm that's only going to leave you with 11 that's no good we could H prime throw we could preemptively try and get some grenades out. That is a strategy that we can employ. I don't know how effective this is, but when in doubt, get the grenades out. I mean, somewhere out there, I guess. That hit nothing. But I'm guessing it put enough of a blanket of cover down. Oh my god, your TU's, Laura, is disgusting. Oh, you're worthless. I hate to call a soldier worthless, but I'm not wrong in this instance. She has zero time units. So this this mission has already cost us. Oh, it's a huge map as well. This mission has already cost us our tank and a soldier. And we've got a metric feck ton of wounded soldiers as well. Everybody's going to be wounded after this. Hey. Do you fancy... Oh, aimed shot. Look at that. 97% chance. Put that right between his ass cheeks. Good kill. Good kill. So yeah, we've already lost a lot of money on this mission. Our only hope is that we can crawl some of that back. I mean, the thing is, this is a very important ship to take. Oh, no, Laura. No. No. Oof. 
she's fine. She is fine. I don't know how she's fine. Right, there he is. Oh no, Emmanuel. That's a bit of a risky maneuver, to be honest. But you can get that between them. Can you guys? Aim shot, look at that, 95%. Ooh, the shot's good. I kind of don't want that grenade to go off now, because that's going to destroy their equipment. So, I mean, that's going to kill him, so I'm not going to worry too much about that. Another one. Aim shot, 95%. Not enough to use. Ah, pathetic. Aim shot. You can do an aim shot at 62%. Pathetic. Aim shot 48%. Pathetic. You guys, you're really going to have to pull us out of the fire here. Solid kill. Nice kill. Good stuff, men. Good stuff. And we're almost on 40 minutes here, guys. So I'm going to have to end this video. <laughs> oh, man. This is some intense shit. This is why I love XCOM. This this is what it's about. <laughs> yeah, we could get completely fucking wiped. I don't know. But I guess we will see what we will see. Anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. And as always, till next time.